Could come here. Come here. Did y'all see Lady Gaga's new goddamn video for GUI? Did you see it? Did you see it? Please tell me you saw it. If you didn't, go grab a defibrillator, go watch it, and then come back and we're gonna talk, okay? Because I can't even breathe right now, okay? Come back, okay? So, Lady Gaga, you know, it's funny. Lady Gaga does this to me very quite often. This is like the third time she's done this to me when I was like fed up with her and her antics. And then she likes whips me right back in with some, some epic shit. And I'll be like, oh, this is why I, this is what I, I live for. Lady Gaga released her new single or her new video for her new single, G-U-Y, from Art Pop. And first of all, I hadn't heard the song until I saw the video. So, because you know I still haven't bought the album because I'm broke. And not to mention, I didn't know if it was going to be a wise investment. Just like I didn't know if Beyonce said it was going to be a wise investment. But I guess it was. So, I guess I'll go. I'm going to go buy the album tomorrow, actually. Just because of this song in this video. So, let me just set it up for you. G-U-Y stands for Girl Under You. This video... Let me just discuss it. And how fucking epic and sickening it is. And this isn't coming from a space of a little monster. Because I told y'all in the last video that I was kind of blowing through my little monster phase. But then this video comes out. And I, I don't even want to see the do what you want, what you want, with value video no more. I don't even care where it is right now. Because GUI gave me everything I needed in this life of sin. Okay? So the video was, okay, the video opens up with her like she's a bird. With the arrow shining her her back. And there's a whole bunch of people in suits fighting over money. Now, here's my assumption of this. You guys know there was this squabble, if you will, with Gaga and her management. And how she had to clean house on the house. No pun intended. The house of Gaga and, you know, get rid of some people. That were allegedly, you know, not there for the right reasons. You know, stealing their money, things of that nature. So, I think that's kind of what that scene represented. You know, they shot her down and then stole her money. And things of that nature. Then just left her ass for dead, okay? Then she picked herself up, got up, you know, got to the castle. And the castle of what I would like to believe is the Little Monsters. And they nursed her back into the amazing Gaga that she is now. So, um, the castle, first of all, is amazing. I would like to visit it. I really would. Like, I've never... I don't like to, like... I don't like sightseeing and stuff like that, but that castle, just seeing this video, like the little shots of that castle, I want to see it. Like, I want to see it live and in person because that castle is beautiful. Just see, it's just scenic. It's like something that, like, sometimes you believe stuff like that is just made for movies, but that's an actual building somewhere, um, I don't know where, over there probably. But, um, anyway, so there's, um... What do you call the people who dance in the water? Synchronized swimmers. Andy Cohen is Zeus in the sky. I think it's Zeus. Or Jesus or somebody in the sky. The Beverly Hills Housewives are singing backup. Playing. Lisa Vanderpump was playing the tambourine. And I died. I was like, Lisa, I love her. So that's all happening in the little castle in the round the pool. And Lady Gaga's in this like headpiece white thing. She just fucking flawless. I just, ooh, she makes me sick how flawless she is. And then, the scene jumps to this dance, this dance area. Big white with like floral, pink and purplish little floral arrangements all around. The dancing in this video, now I came for her, uh, I came for Richard as of recently because of the dancing in Lady Gaga's video seemed to start to go into a voguing gay club type of stuff and that's what I was getting out of all of her choreography since Richard has taken over. However, this these the dancing in this video, Richie, you did that, Richard. You did all of that. All of the dance sequences. From that one to the one in the uh little laboratory 
the one in the um by the pool side in the low not by the pool side but well yeah the pool side too and if he synchronized them synchronized swimmers he need a goddamn Emmy okay um well um there was a scene where she's like indoors but it was like an indoor pool but it looks like it was a room too it was just just oh she was giving me straight um down to tell Versace okay now, you know, I had an issue with her and her little Versace character, but in the video, it was cute because it was just like the area seemed so down to tell Versace that it was OK because they're like intertwined. Now, when you see you don't see down to tell Versace walking around the streets of Jersey, that's when it gets awkward. So um, next thing. Oh, so she brings back to life. Um, Jesus. Gandhi, Michael Jackson, and who else was the other person? Somebody from the Beatles. What is his name? I had to Google it because the scene on the video didn't show exactly the fourth casket. Uh, somebody from the Beatles. I forget his name. Is it Lennon? Is it John Lennon? I don't remember. Somebody from the Beatles. And what I'm assuming she's doing is taking the blood from these four people and the, essentially the qualities that she wants in her team and her... In, a guy for that matter and she's like getting rid of all the guys she her and the housewives went up and cleaned house in the little building area okay I'm assuming it was the house of Gaga she went up in there shot some money around you to the you know decipher the fakes from the reels the fake people went for the money they probably killed all their asses and then replace them with the GUIs, which are, you know, the people with the Gandhi blood and the Jesus blood and the man from the Beatles blood and Michael Jackson blood. The video was just fucking epic. And the song is fucking epic. And I can't stop listening to it. And I fucking love her again. And she does this to me every time. Every time I get ready to doubt her, she comes back and she just smacks the shit out of me and say, don't do it again. It was just amazing. If you haven't watched it, please go watch it. It's an incredible video. And um, let me know what you guys think in the gotcha, 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 gotcha bar. <laughs> and be sure to follow the Facebook fan page, facebook.com backslash number one fan monster for no more updates and things of that nature. I wonder if I can get a hat that says G-U-Y instead of B-O-Y. I'm going to try to work on that. And I love you guys for watching. Peace.